the city prepares for its bicentennial celebration in June, there's a push to make sure the history of the African-American community in Jacksonville is not overlooked. Today, the city announced plans for its 200th birthday. And News for Jackson reporter Scott Johnson joins us live now from City Hall. He was there for today's announcement. Scott. Mary, the big celebration will be here in James Weldon Johnson Park, right in front of City Hall, where I'm at, in mid-June. June 11th is the big day, but leading up to that, we talked to the mayor and the Jacksonville Historical Society about all the things that will be going on today. They answered questions about the city's plans, uh, along with Mayor Curry. One of the people asking questions about these plans to celebrate their 200th birthday, Jacoby Pibman. She's a local city councilwoman. She had plans about how we're going to celebrate the African-American history in the city. Organizers say they will that will be a big part of the celebration over the next few months. I think with the city celebrating 200 years, it's really important that we celebrate the African American history that we have here as well. And to be a part of the process when you think about the churches and the villa and Hollywood of the South, that we want to make sure that the communities here are addressed and celebrated as well. So the big celebration on the 11th, as I said, will be out here. They'll have a few other downtown spots. It's open to the public. It's free. You're encouraged to attend. Expect big crowds. And I talked to the mayor about it earlier tonight that back when we turned 100 in 1922, it didn't sound like the city did very much. They're trying to make up for it this year for the 200th. We're live downtown at City Hall. Scott Johnson, Channel 4, the local station.